Hi there, it's Christine Richardson here, Natural Healing. So today I'm going to share with you a few reasons why it's best to prepare your oats, your breakfast oats, the night before. So the main number one reason is hydration. So you always want to be eating and thinking about the highest level of hydration of your food uh, possible. So swollen foods, we call it as naturopaths. Swollen foods means that they are full of water. Your oats are obviously dry, they're dried grains, um, grain flakes. So when you're eating um, a lot of dried food, and let's talk just about breakfast cereal, but you can then translate that into anything else, your other foods. When you're eating a lot of dried foods, then your body requires a lot of water to digest that and actually make it um, usable, the nutrients and extract the nutrients from the food. And what it does is uh, it actually pulls that water from areas in your body where it's being used at the moment for other things or stored. Don't forget, our bodies are 70% water, our brains are 85% water, okay? So digestion takes a huge amount of energy but it also takes a huge amount of water. Now, don't mistake this with drinking water whilst you're eating because that's an absolute no-no because you're just diluting all your digestive enzymes and you're just practically flushing it through and it doesn't really get to um, uh, be digested properly. So, but what does really work is preparing your oats the night before. So what you would do is do the same thing that you would, the same process that you would do in the morning, but do it at night and start it then. So you would take your oats, say just one portion, and you uh, either do it like I would do it in a pot because I like mine warm. So I will warm them up the next morning. If you eat them cold, you can just do it straight into your bowl. Then you use your preferred milk. I would always recommend a nut or seed milk over dairy or you use water and you just cover your oats in that liquid. If you want it, you could add some raisins at this point um, and they will also then hydrate and swell overnight. Same thing what the oats are doing. So then imagine the next morning, obviously you prepare your oats the same way you usually would. You add anything to it like fruit, or you uh, warm them up like I do and add your fruit to them after and decorate them nicely with little bits like cacao nibs or raw cacao powder or whatever it is you want to use. Um, but then you're getting a uh, swollen food so the, the water has properly soaked in and softened your oats, softened your raisins as well, and it allows for a much easier digestive uh, process inside of you. Because just imagine the difference between putting something really dry into your body, um, that yes, you might have that with your milk or your water, or putting something that is soaked um, into your body uh, and swollen. And the body just prefers swollen foods because the high in water content and liquid content and that just helps the body to replenish the the water content in it rather than you know take away from its water content and deplete the body of water so when you've been listening to my uh, videos the recent ones water is the number one uh, medicine in nature really we just totally underestimate this amazing um, element and what impact it has on our health. So the more water swollen foods you can add, uh, the better. So there you go. Prepare your oats uh, the night before and let them swell uh, and let them take up all that wonderful hydration so that it's much easier and gentler on your digestive system and you will be able to hydrate at the same time in the best possible way and you'll be able to um, digest and absorb those nutrients in the optimum way. So here you go. Uh, I hope you enjoy that and let me know how you get on 
Um, who's tried soaking their oats the night before? Who hasn't? I'd really love to know. So comment below this video and we can have a chat. Thank you. Bye.